another blow to Ukraine's ruling coalition. The center-right Samopomich party is the latest to leave, citing, quote, a conspiracy between the government and the country's oligarchs. This comes after the fatherland faction of ex-premier Yulia Tymoshenko also left the alliance. Both parties combined hold 45 seats in parliament. Their exit means an end to the coalition's parliamentary majority. Tymoshenko explains her position. We need to make sure that all the democratic and honest deputies leave this clan-like coalition. If the coalition has less than 226 deputies, then it will no longer exist. This is the official coalition which was covering the oligarch conspiracy and the actual oligarch coalition. A vote of no confidence in the government failed to pass on Tuesday. That came amid corruption accusations and calls for Prime Minister Arseniy Yatsenyuk to step down, including from President Poroshenko. Two dozen members from the president's bloc did not vote for Yatsenyuk's resignation. That despite earlier signing a decree asking for the no-confidence vote. Some reform-minded MPs say they know why the vote failed. There was a large number of MPs who played very unfair. They signed the decree but didn't vote. They had cards and just left before the vote. And these are people from Poroshenko's inner circle. The government in fighting threatens to derail 17.5 billion U.S. dollars IMF bailout. Yatsenyuk says he is in talks with various political groups to shore up the coalition. Failure to do so could result in snap elections.